guys, we have some great news. My mom just called me and told us that we got the house. We got the house. <laughs> this is where we're gonna be living. Oh my god! We are currently um, in front of the house. Right now, we are having a moment of just appreciation. This is just yeah. what our life would be like. We drive home, park in our driveway. You can't see it. You <laughs> can't see it now yet. It. We're so excited. A new chapter of our lives. I don't know if you guys could tell by my intro to this video. I am moving. Here's the catch. This time I will be moving into a house. You guys can't really see the excitement. I'm still kind of in shock about this whole moving process. I'm currently going through it right now. So I've just been excited and happy and at the same time just mind blown that this is happening. I've obviously visited the house. I toured it at the beginning and I don't know if you guys ever remember. It was in one of my videos and I immediately fell in love with it and decided to put in an application for it. I'm lucky to actually be accepted. A big part of me being able to do this goes to you guys. So I do want to thank you guys extremely. I know it's cheesy. I know youtubers do it a lot, but it's also because we are extremely thankful for you guys I highly recommend subscribing if you guys are new here. This moving series is gonna be long I didn't really get to do this with my last apartment at all I am renting this property and I am gonna be moving in with three of my other friends You won't be seeing the entire house in this video. You'll get like tiny glimpse of it With all that being said, we are gonna start the moving process and that starts with the apartment. Found it Fuck it up. Ah, fuck it up. We're sweaty buddies. Look at my armpits. It's because I go in the freezer and then I like cool off. First things first, we're gonna tackle the bathroom. I am so excited to show you guys my new bathroom. This is literally the most difficult thing just to get this freaking tape on. How the frick is anyone supposed to get that in one? Or am I an idiot? Maybe I am an idiot. I do want to apologize for the poor lighting in my bathroom that you guys might be seeing throughout this video. Luckily, this is the last time we will have to deal with this. Thankful for that. So it's day two. I did not really get much done yesterday in terms of packing. I did the bathroom and got like one cover done and that was about it. But today, I will be tackling my closet. So this is what my lovely closet looked like beforehand. I was definitely not the best at keeping it organized. I will say I was working as best as I could with what I was given. This is literally what the bottom of my closet looked like a majority of the time. As you can tell, it was a struggle to keep everything in one place. Another reason why I'm excited to play this place. I didn't even know it was connected to this. And I thought I was recording when I took down the collage wall that was right here. I wasn't filming so I just took all of them down a little tip for you guys if you guys don't want to like get them all stuck together I would recommend taping like two together I would take two at a time down and then I would just stick them together that way like each side doesn't have tape on it taking them apart like two at a time is a lot easier and then just being able to kind of like reuse the tape I do plan to probably just stick these up somewhere I don't know exactly what I'll do with them I just want to make sure that they don't get ruined <music> 
my room just looks really messy but that's okay because we're moving out all these stuff will be out of here soon anyways also i have a massive headache because the fire alarms in this entire apartment are going off from 9 a.m to 5 p.m for four days straight so conveniently it goes to the day that i move out they've been going off between like minutes of each other so within one hour there's probably like 20 or 25 of them going off which is incredibly annoying as you might imagine we are going to be tearing down the wall that i'm looking at right now for some reason the idea of taking all of this down really made me kind of sad i realized there are a lot of memories tied to this room and it's kind of hitting me so although i did have my struggles living in this room i still am thankful for everything that has happened here like friendships sleepovers moments of just pure joy have happened in this room and it's kind of hard to let that go anyways it's time to tear it down take you guys along with me to the inspection and the walkthrough right now we have to make sure that everything's good to go for when we do move in you guys are gonna get a little glimpse of the house right now and i'm so excited to show you guys so and also my roommate this is her first time seeing it too so this is my room so i'm gonna be living <laughs> this is my room no i oh, love the picture of this right <laughs> i wanted to like bake every week mm -hmm. and like mm -hmm. i want to put like you love cooking like, I do love cooking. Dude. I'll probably bake every week because mm -hmm. I'll be happy to be here. <laughs> I'll put like a thing right here, like a, you know those baking things with the glass top? Oh! Like, you know those things? Like, 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 yeah. Guys, I'm the first person to shit in this house. <laughs> I do need to make sure that by the time I move out that I fix this and also take this out because that's like stuck and glued into the wall. I will definitely get fined if I don't have those fixed by the time I do move out. Then I decided to tackle underneath my bed and uh, I think it pretty much speaks for itself. <laughs> I am using my time wisely and attempts to also escape the fire alarms going off this morning I already started packing up some bags clothes and I think I might just drop those off at the house right now I'm gonna grab some coffee as well just to get the day started it's basically one day to move in and I think I'm just gonna do like a separate vlog on the whole empty house tour <laughs> Guys, I'm doing this in the most efficient way possible. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I've been kind of wearing the same outfits on repeat just because I moved all of my clothes to the house. So obviously, since they're all there and I have like a few pieces of things here, I've just been wearing the same things. So today my family comes and they're gonna help me move everything else. I haven't been able to move any of my heavy boxes just because I can't move them by myself. Then this large mirror that 
is uh, very heavy, which I cannot also do. And plus my car does not fit it. I don't have to be out of this complex till the end of this month. This entire apartment isn't gonna be fully empty of like all my things. I do have some other mirrors out in the living room that I have to take also. This moving process has been a little bit difficult just because I have been doing most of it on my own, except for my boyfriend who's been helping me. I also just took apart my bed right now. So I have like all my pillows and my duvet cover ready to take over to the other place. My bed frame and my desk came in. So I had to go over there to like bring in the stuff into my house. Something on my channel, yeah. <sighs> No. You said you always wanted to be on camera. This is not what I want to be <laughs> this lighting is so good. I'm taking over the vlog, guys. I'm gonna give you a house tour. I'm just kidding. No, I'm not. Okay. We discovered a hack that might have been helpful maybe like two heavy boxes ago. You can just wheel it down the hallway and that way it's a lot easier and less heavy duty, heavy working stuff. And it's just me and my mom, so. <laughs> technical difficulties. Careful. Ha, ha, ha.